Hello out there, here's Bertrand Becher. I wanted to show you today this little microphone, but I decided to put it into a instructional contents. So um, this video is about how to hold harmonica microphone. This is a special small one. Where to get it, I can link it in the description below. And I'm using the Zydel Hyper Amp, which is warmed up already. Um, and a lightning harmonica in the key of a G. So, this is how it sounds. Hold the microphone in your hand like this. Keep a little distance between the harmonica and the microphone and then cup it as if you want to blow off, blow up a balloon or you hold an apple and hold it really tight. And if you do so, it sounds like this. Without the microphone. Problems occur when players do not cup their microphones the right way. So they have to really be airtight. You can use this opening effect to sound a little bit more trebly and a little bit more um, soft um, and not so punchy. But if you want to do a really good solo, you have to cup your harmonica microphone and have a good acoustic tone in order to get out the best out of your tube amp. By the way, this tube amp has a gain control and a volume control and an effect. Is, the effect is a little bit turned on in order to do a little bit of reverb. Um, and um, yeah, I tend not to uh, use a lot of effect, but a little bit only, so. more but a little bit is just enough so again this is the difference between a cupped tone and an open tone especially with this microphone you can get a good um, difference <laughs> between a single note and if you cup and do a double note so this gives the the punch that you like to hear if you think of Chicago harmonica or splitting like this so, but always cup your microphone, otherwise you get only weak sounds out of the best microphone and the best amplifier. So this was my little lecture. I hope you liked it and um, be safe. <laughs>